think uh, uh, Bangalore had uh, in India and across the globe had the highest participation. Uh, here we had around 400 uh, people registered and 300 wrote the particular event and completed the event. We have scheduled an event on uh, September 11th, uh, 2021 to celebrate 100 years of randomness and okay. this is happening across the globe. So today, 100th anniversary of Randonier. So my best wishes to each and every one of you. It's, it's a wonderful time to see all of you in such a large number. In fact, I was shocked when I came here. Since the participation was very huge and we just wanted to ensure that everybody is part of this uh, mega event. Uh, on this particular day, uh, we are going to celebrate the 100 years of random learning, the first breve. Uh, was held in uh, 1921 in Paris with 26 riders, a 200 km ride to celebrate that. Uh, so this date is important. Uh, generally, Bangalore rides a little tougher, uh, being a centenary, and we wanted everybody to complete and earn the special 100 year centenary medal, uh, we kept this ride as a little simple ride for riders to finish. Uh, cycling culture has been in Bangalore for a long time and it has picked up uh, post-Covid uh, because during the Covid times uh, people didn't have any other option to get out and cycling was the only option that was available and due to the health reasons also. Uh, people have picked up cycling for, it could be breves, it could be leisure travel riding or training uh, just for short rides with friends and families uh, and it has spread across the spectrum from teenagers to the old people who even retired people taking up cycling uh, for the pleasure of it. Uh, from the random and perspective also we see a 3x or 4x increase in cycling. Cycling also uh, gives an option for people to come together in the early morning, go on a 25 km or 50 km ride, uh, then explore the, the breakfast joints uh, and just have breakfast together and have a nightly chat and then get back to the routine work.
and we had a record participation of uh, more than 40 females in that. Uh, as a matter of respect, uh, we have been giving a free ride to that it's so that they have earned that particular registration for the particular event. And the community has grown and I think Spokeswoman has been a great platform for all these females to come, either it could be random or ring racing or... I'm excited about the desert over here. I think I'm going to probably come for a second round special for the desert. So we yeah, are in it, having fun. Super. We are going to have more fun riding that. I think overall 40 registered, but that's over split over two days. So totally, I think approximately around 40, 40 45. 40, 45. Yeah, right. so and so and it's, like it's a 10% first time women. in BRM. These many women are riding. Who touch her? Na gita pa? That is all. All. Masrana, 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 On the secondary ride, we had more than uh, 50 rookies who started off the first ride. One is the location to start and uh, end, uh, and uh, to ensure on the route uh, everybody is safe enough uh, in terms of the logistics, in terms of the food arrangements if any that we need to do uh, the registration the back end work uh, during the flag off uh, these are some of the challenges that we have. I think I have been very lucky at Bangalore Random to have a very good support team and the community uh, and I see everybody coming forward and trying to do the best. Favorite uh, is not just uh, cycling and uh, ensuring that you finish the ride in a fixed time. So one is they get to meet people from different uh, fields, get to interact with them uh, at the nice places, enjoy the local scenery, click photos, uh, it could be historical places, parks, lakes, on the en route. Uh, they also get the chance to taste the local cuisine, uh, meet the local people, try to understand uh, the, the culture and stuff like that. 
and uh, it also gives an opportunity for people from outside who are coming from outside to interact with them and to see how is the cycling culture in different places.